Hi, I'm Peter Ibercola with Shortel. I'm an area sales manager on Boston. And today's presentation is to give a very quick, non-technical overview of what N plus one redundancy means and why it's important to your customers and why it's important that you sell N plus one redundancy. Okay? So we're going to start, we're going to use the whiteboard and we're going to start drawing out a very, very basic Shortel configuration. So I've already drawn out a short gear switch. We don't put numbers in here. We're not trying to confuse anybody. It doesn't matter if it's a short gear 120, short gear 60, short gear 220. For this purpose, it's a short gear switch. So it goes back. The mantra needs to be Shortel is very scalable, Shortel is very modular, and Shortel is extremely reliable. And N plus 1 redundancy gets us to the most reliable statistics of any voice manufacturer out there. So what does N plus 1 redundancy mean? So what I've drawn here is I've drawn a short gear switch. Okay, what I have not drawn is a power over ethernet switch. And I'm gonna draw it in here just for one. It's a power over ethernet with quality of service. We've talked about what quality of service means. It means that voice is going to be prioritized over other traffic, and your phones are ultimately connected to this power over ethernet switch via a LAN that's resident in a customer's building, okay? As you build a short tail system, depending on the number of people you add, you keep on adding short gear switches. They're very modular, okay? Not putting the numbers again, okay? Add another switch, and you can keep on doing this basically ad infinitum to support the number of people that you have. For today's purposes, I'm gonna draw three. Now, as we talked about in another presentation, short gear switches by themselves provide 99.999% Reliability by themselves, five minutes of downtime estimated per year. Each switch has a mean time between failure of somewhere between 28 and 30 years. Incredibly reliable systems. N plus one redundancy increases that grade. So, what does N plus one redundancy mean to a customer? Well, this component here equals N. Doesn't matter how many short gear switches you have, that component is going to equal N. So, it can be one, it can be 10, it can be 20. Your plus one component is this component up here. It's going to be one additional short gear switch. Okay, there's your plus one. So this equals plus one. All right, so that's great. What does this mean to an end user customer and how does it work and how does it give me more reliability than I had before? Well, what happens here is each of these short gear switches is an independent entity. There's no master, there's no slave relationship here. They are all egalitarian or equal on your network. So they work together. Now, in a very unfortunate event or unlikely event that a short gear switch fails, okay, that's failure. And failure can happen for a couple of reasons. Water is very bad for electronics. A lightning storm, very bad for electronics as well. They don't fail very often, but when they do fail, you can build in what's called N plus one redundancy. So how does it work? Well, what happens is this short gear phone is programmed to a switch, okay? And that short gear phone is looking for a switch, looking for that switch. As soon as that switch becomes available, that short gear phone looks for another available port here on the short gear 120. Now, for purposes of this demonstration, we've left this short gear switch here completely empty. In the real world, we wouldn't do that. We would load balance these different switches. So you have a certain number of users on each of the switches and you'd have a certain number of analog backup trunks on each of the switches. But for today's purpose. So what happens is, short gear switch goes out, short gear phone looks for an available, available port over here, it gets dialed. Okay? This is called IP phone failover, and you accomplish this by doing N plus one redundancy. The beauty of this design versus that of our competition is, in a normal world, you have to do what's either called one plus one redundancy, or N plus N redundancy, depending on whatever your mathematic, mathematical formula would be. So what does that mean? Well, if I built four short gear switches, I need to get, to get that redundancy, I need to build in four additional short gear switches, quadrupling the, the potential cost of providing redundancy. That's what our competition provides. It's the same thing in N plus N, plus N redundancy. So why, why is N plus one redundancy important? What does it give you? Well, N plus one redundancy is the best type of redundancy for two reasons. It's the least expensive type of redundancy. To provide it here for a short gear 120 by 24 is a list price of $5,000. It also provides the most uptime. It increases this 5.9 reliability to seven 
nines, reliability, okay? It puts availability off the charts. Mean time between failure has increased to about 400 years in this location. So very simplistic drawing here, but it does provide the beauty of what N plus run redundancy is gonna to provide to your customers. Again, N, number of switches, plus one is the number of short gear switches you need to provide N plus one redundancy. A couple things to keep in mind. We, we do not support, at this time, N plus one redundancy across the network. We do not provide automatic IP phone failover across the network. If you sell it, short sales TAC will not support it. Okay? It may be available in a future release. Do not sell it. It's not available today. Automatic failover is not provided across the link. Okay? One other thing to note, which you may get questions on, is we provide automatic IP phone failover, meaning a phone will fail over to another switch. We don't provide automatic failback. Okay? Phones will not, when a switch becomes available, it will not fail back to another switch. We do that because it will cause unnecessary interruptions in the services. So again, why N plus one redundancy? The most available, seven nines availability, the least expensive, $5,000 maximum per switch.